And boom. Looks like we are live. Uh, let me know if you hear me okay. I did my best to make sure all the settings were correct, but you know, you never know. Still kind of new with this whole thing? And oh. boom. Looks like we are live. Got to turn it down on my phone so we don't get that weird radio delay. <laughs> cool, cool. All right, let's make sure we've got uh, audio from our music making stuff here. Hmm. Is that coming through? The little weird sounds? Because if so, then we can get going. Let's wait for a response. Got nothing better to do here? Full HD would be better. You greedy motherfuckers. I'm out here in the middle of nowhere, live streaming off an LTE cube. I can't even get wired internet here. And you guys are like, I want full HD. Well, you know what? You're gonna have to live with this. Sorry, buddy. How about I send you a VHS tape next time? All right, let's get going. Yeah, it's supposed to, it's a quiet sound, don't worry. All right, so what are we doing here today? Uh, I have been requested to produce a dark wave track. Uh, so that's what I'm gonna do. Um, we're gonna see how much we can get through in about an hour. See, uh, see what we come up with. Uh, as you can see, I've got a, um, Got a uh, uh, an empty project here, so uh, we are literally starting from scratch, but we will cheat a little bit. But that's how the music business goes. <clears throat> so uh, I'm thinking, what is sort of the what are the like trademarks of like, you know, dark wave in 2020? Um, I imagine that it is uh, kind of retro, but has nice production. Uh, so I'm thinking like Lindrum sounds, some uh, twangy guitar, shit like that. So uh, what we're gonna do we're just gonna we're just gonna start this track. Uh, I don't know if 120 beats per minute is gonna work, but we're just gonna figure it out. So the way that I'm going to cheat is I'm going to load up a drum kit that was produced by Native Instruments. Um, and I think the one that gets us the sort of like Lin drum sound. It's gonna be our neon drive kit, or neon lights kit, I'm sorry. So let's see. Ooh, I don't like that. That doesn't sound like a Lindrum. What's this one? Nope. <clears throat> I thought it was this one. Paradise? It's a PC machine. Ooh. That 
that's close. Better kick. No. It's really not this? No, it's all the kicks. No. Ew. Oh. Ooh, Kelly Knight? Motherfucker. All right. Fuck that. New kit. All right. Let's go to my samples. Find a Lynn kick. if I'm going to go crazy with the toms, but let's just get them in there in case we need them. Ah! That sucks. See in the top left corner, this is Logic Pro. All right, we need a closed hat, and then I think we're good enough for the start. Black keys, black keys, motherfucker, black keys, there we go. Why are you doing this? Tom's here. Slow for one twenty. Faster. All 
right, and because we don't want kick and snare to walk over each other, put the snare on a different track or a different output, create track, boom. Now snare, kick. I think that's more interesting. Quantize. Duplicate. Need my MIDI to be smaller because I hate when it's so big, it gets in the way. All right, so I'm not really a guitar player, but you don't need to be to make this kind of music. So uh, I'm just gonna just gonna make a guitar riff. Copy this, create a good loop. Guitar, what kind of tone do we need? All right. Let's get our trusty more here it's in our library. Uh, so yeah, we want something echoey like that. But it needs a little more grit, so I'm gonna turn on my OCD pedal. All right. Uh, we wanna, let's see if my classic rock one tone works for this. It's here. Yeah, that's good. A lot of noise in that. I don't know if that's coming through on your end, but it will when I record it. Let's see. Yeah, that comes through for you. Okay, good. All right, um, so this sort of delay is a good way. I think. Let's fuck with the tone a little bit. It's a little boomy. Let's see how it sounds recorded. Um, the guitar will come through when it is recorded, don't worry. Ah, it's on the wrong. Aha. Why is it not? Oh. That's why it's on the wrong input. There you go.
that works. So, what we're going to do is turn off the delay and we'll put the delay in later. So, delay off. Two and four. Two and four? All right. So um, I write everything in G almost because I like the way G cuts through. So um, I'm just gonna write some riffs uh, that follow a uh, harmonic minor. I don't need any other notes than that. I was thinking, like I was thinking about it earlier, I was like, maybe I wanna go like darker and do like diminished second and five, but. It gets a little too metal. Yeah, it's too dark, too too heavy for that stuff. So we're gonna we're just gonna fuck around with the. in that it need to be D okay all right here we go Let's record that riff and then we'll choose our favorite one later or we'll just kind of spread out the riffs across the song. That one. All right, let's record it twice. That one's a little off time. I like that. That's our chorus. That's going to 
gonna be hard to come back to. All right. Oh, I think it's the delay that's fucking me up. Because it's always a little bit behind, right? It's obnoxious. Gotta be good enough. All right. Yeah, that sucks. It's the fucking delay of all of the the guitar having to run through the computer and all of that shit. Cause it's uh, it goes through the man. That sucks. Alright, let's see if we can cheat. That's really cheating if we cheat. God damn it. think about that but no time to dilly dally we have a track to make so uh, we need a retro synth don't we so so a good Jupiter sound profit profit Do not take suggestions. All right, since we clearly can't play anything, well, no, we can probably play it by audio. Uh, but I'm gonna cheat. Cause we don't have time to fuck around, do we? So.
And I'll tell you why I don't take suggestions, because this song is nowhere near where it's going to be in about half an hour. So when people try to give their input on something that is not even uh, where it should be yet, If you can't hear the big picture, you can't make a suggestion. Major scope creep within the parameters of the project? I have n What? I did look up at the Vocaloid thing. Maybe you were the one that suggested it to me. And while I think it's cool, it's probably not for what I do. save this.
Oh, come on. It's like right on the tip of my tongue. Oh, it's right there. Come on. It's supposed to be 80s. That's the... That's the... That's the job. scale yeah maybe that back up to C
not sure if that works. So what we're going to do is create two versions. And we can always go back to it. Phrygian? <laughs> Phrygian. This is just a harmonic minor. I'm gonna have to stop looking at the chat because you motherfuckers in with your suggestions, it's like terrible. This is not sound design right now. This is, I, this is ideas. The ideas are so much more important than the sound. The sound comes later. The sound is like the last thing you worry about. Jesus. time. No time for love, Dr. Jones.
All right, now we've got the meat and potatoes. Now we can produce it, motherfuckers. All right, always make sure your kick drum is in tune with your root note. If you do not tune your drums, you suck as a producer. Bum, 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 bum. G. Give me a G. drum is too far away from the root to work. Shit. I like that kick. tuning to the fundamental. Here's the thing with modern new music that wants to sound old. All the drums of the past sound like shit.
So you gotta layer them with modern drums.
Let's try a pop snare. Pretty heavy for pop music. don't like that snare, but I'm going to have to live with it for now.
don't like that. change it, sure. sort of done, you know, in that sense. Still not sure if I'm feeling that pan shit. Sausage fattener ain't working either. Double lock.
gonna sing lyrics. All right, that's our vocals. I never sing this low. Lyrics. I sing lyrics. Even the voice is delayed. Fucking god damn it. All right. I'll fix this later. But I wanted to get this idea down. That's how all the, the shitty singers in the scene hide how shitty they sound when they sing by <laughs> covering it in distortion. I'm going to record my chorus vocals and then I'm done. Oh fuck, what was I singing? Shit.
I think I think no words. I think no words. All right, we're done. All right, so that is my dark wave song that I wrote in an hour and 15 minutes. Um, obviously, it needs more production and sound design and all that kind of stuff, but this is basically how you write a song. You just kind of choose your scale um, and uh, just fart around on it until something sounds cool. Um, think of syncopation, think of just melodies that uh, can combine to make something interesting and uh that's how you write a song thank you all for hanging out with me and watching watching this go down um if you'd like to uh take part in future watch me work live streams please consider checking out my patreon uh, i do those once a month and i do it with tracks that are for myself instead of tracks that are for other people uh, like this one is and uh to all my patrons out there, thank you for your support and thank you for watching. And to you all, to the rest of you, have a lovely Tuesday afternoon, morning, evening, whatever it is for y'all. Take it easy. I'll see you next time. Bye.